I don't know what people mean by multiple registers, mm -hmm. but of course we know that there were some errors. Uh, some people's uh, biometrics were not captured, right. and these are the areas we are going to be looking at. Was there happened. one register just? Or yeah, two? and the Elections Act describes the principal register. Mm -hmm. And of course the principal register is made up of uh, registers at the constituencies, and that is something that is described in the law. But of course, because we had backup during the last general election, I think this is what people keep referring to as multiple registers. Okay. But as far as IBC is concerned, we have a principal register. So what is it you found as IEBC, the lack of accuracy? When you say there were certain elements that were missing, there were also occasions where even during the um, presidential petition, we had of a green book, then there was this other. So it was the backup representative of everything that was in the principal register, or were there some, uh, was there some information captured in one and not in the other? Because then that's what the issue of multiple registers comes in. Yeah, you know, the, the principal register is what we captured in the biometrics right yeah when we went for registration we took your biometrics and that is what we went to the principal register mm -hmm. but of course because we were employing that technology for the first time on a large scale general election then we we had the the, the book where we were recording you know as you come in you fill a form the form a so that means our we you know we had the manual details right. of each and every register such that uh, by the time we were going for elections some of those who had not been captured their biometrics were not captured mm -hmm. but were uh, in that green book uh, and of course if they were captured and uh, you know we printed that register mm -hmm. then they were able to vote and we did not want to disenfranchise any Kenyan in that election. Yeah. So in the next election, in as far as the register is concerned, what is it that we're going to see now and in the days to come before then to ensure that there's just one register and there's no um, you know, room to question or wonder if there's another place where this information is listed? Yeah, definitely we are doing an audit mm -hmm. of the principal register. As I said earlier, there were errors, and these errors have to be con corrected. Yeah. There were people who actually uh, went and were registered, but unfortunately they did not appear. So even those people we will want to find out, you know, when we open for continuous voter registration, mm -hmm. we will want them to come back and try and, you know, recapture their biometrics again. Yeah. So generally, just to audit uh, the areas of the register which we need to correct,